What's up, guys? Pleasure George here, back from another video. And today we're at 7,216 trophies, currently top 822 in the world. But 10 days, 10 hours out of the season, I kind of tilted like 400, I mean, 200 trophies, but that's alright. Um, it's basically untilting, and I just saw the balance changes. Hope you guys enjoyed your previous video. If you did, drop like, subscribe, and just follow for more logbait content, I guess. The balance changes are really interesting because all like the hard counters of log bait is getting nerfed. Like the um, cannon cart, uh, mortar, and hogs. That's like really annoying cards. And also they're adding back the third spear goblin, which is very nice. Because maybe goblin gang can be viable again. And it looks like we're going against, um, going against the elixir golem here because he has healer. That's like the only deck that has rage and healer. I'm only rocketing when he plays his legs for golem. If he doesn't, what in the world is this man doing? Okay, I'm just gonna throw a gone barrel here, go for skeletons like this, to cycle to my skeletons. Okay, that was horrible. He might freeze, so let's get ready for the fire spirit. Okay, what? Okay, I'm not gonna question this guy, just like spit you bars randomly. Maybe a lag. Let's go for fire spirit here. Keep our keeping our cannon alive. Uh, I'm just going for a princess, applying pressure, because my cannon's still alive, and it will kill whatever he plays. Yeah, I'll force out the arrows. I'm just going for a gone bro, and he's going to zap it, and I should get some damage. Looks like Golem is a really easy matchup. Mm, okay. You just want to rocket. Whenever you see Elixir Golem plus Healer, you want to rocket the two, because the faster you kill Elixir Golem, the easier you can um, defend. So they're going to try to overwhelm you with Swarm Elixir Golem, so you're going to try to rocket it whenever they give you value. Like here, uh, once you play something else, I'm going to rocket, but if he doesn't, I'm still going to rocket. Okay. Okay, that's fine, because I'll be killed that, and I'll pop the ability here to kill um, Battle Healer, and I don't think you gotta worry about that, because he still has to deal with the Mining Miner. Let's go for a Gone Brawl as well, be annoying. And... Yeah. Okay, Princess is gonna die, but he takes some damage. Let's go for a Princess here. Log, Goblin Barrel, and then Fire Spirit up high. Nice. Okay, for the arrows. Looking really good. Okay, he's gonna go for it like a desperate Elixir Golem push, so. Let's go for Cannon here. Princess in the back, help splash onto whatever he plays. I'm not going to go for okay. It's giving me this rocket value. I'm gonna take that. Now I'm going for this. Gone barrel applying pressure while defending. Okay, that is very really crazy. Now I'm pop the ability here for high skellies just in case. Okay, he goes with interesting arrows there. Yeah, that's almost a flawless defense. Fire spring in case he has freeze. Nope, does not have freeze, and yeah, it's gonna be GG. You just want to get rocket value with like electric golem plus one more card. Like Inferno Dragon or Elixir Golem plus Bow Healer, and it should be easy to defend from there. Alright, guys, next match here against Nesty. Kind of loaded in late for some reason. So I'm just gonna go for a Gone Barrel here. And yeah, he's gonna go for the Rogue Ghost. I've been seeing so much Rogue Ghost lately, it's kind of crazy. I'm um, just going for a Cannon here and try to activate our King Tower. Please. Oh, the Cannon killed the E Spirit. Kind of um, messed that up. That's fine. We're just gonna go for a mining miner here against giant skeleton. And you might be playing RG or balloon. I don't know. But kind of will get kind of sketchy in these moments. Okay. So it was free rocket value. Yeah, I'm gonna pop the ability here of the money miner to make it survive. It is gonna get minus eight percent HP nerf, so maybe it'll be like not overpowered as it is right now. Yeah, I'm really hoping. I'm um, just praying that Classic Bait can be viable again, because it's, it's like my favorite deck to play. Um, okay, he puts that in the other lane, so we're good. Go for a high Fire Spirit, that was kind of a fail, but that's fine. He's gonna have a ability, I'm gonna let that go. Uh, focus on the Rogue Ghost, um, okay. I think we should take some damage. Okay, that could have been better, but really annoying how everything next to that one HP there. Right, let's go Princess here. And we do not want to go Sam land against our G player because they counter push you to death. Man, it's not fun. 
Okay, I'm just going for a barrel here. Um, my men are like this. Hopefully he kills it and the fisherman sucks it in. Okay, that's fine. Okay, goes in RG. And really beautiful road ghost there. Okay, he played an E Spirit too early so he can get away with a. Log this and fires. Hopefully it does no damage. Okay, wow. Let's go Princess like this. Pop the ability here. Help defend. Okay, that's gonna be good. Let's go for Gombrel. Just applying pressure. High skill. I like to force out the ability early. Um, ability nowhere to be found. Okay, he just wasted his logs. Let's go for Barrel Barrel here. You gotta watch out for RG. Um, okay, let's go Skylights like this. We do get some damage, but I would like some more, but that's fine. Let's go for a log here. And yeah, Princess, please stay alive. Okay, let's go with a Mind Winner here. I don't know if it was worth it or not, but hopefully it forces out the Arch Queen. Pretty massive. Um, let's go for another Princess here. Maybe banning out the log. Okay, he decides to log that. Uh, let's go for Skellies and Rocket. Okay, that Rocket was... I'm not sure about that, but... Okay. I'm going for a log here. Skellies. Yeah, RG is a super hard matchup because they can just stack troops. You only have one Mining Miner, so it's going to get defended by his Fisherman. Okay, that's a lot of stuff, so kind of be careful here. Let's go with a hammer like this. Right, fire spurt here. Oh, he's lightning as well. Okay, that's super annoying. Okay, I've got a sack cannon there and a log. Yeah, the Archmaid still gets one hit out of everything. Yeah, well, these are one of the decks that prevent me from like pushing higher because it's very hard to beat these. And they're pretty common in the meta. And I'm hoping like Classic Bait will be back because Inferno Tower Ice Spirit will shut down RG. Yeah. This is not the best because they can just spell down your cards and stack RGs and just play Fisherman for your money miner can't do much to defend, but GG's though. Alright, next match here against Bartex, so we're just gonna go for Fire Spirit here and see what's up. He's not gonna do anything, so for Gombra on the corner. I like to play my Gombra on the corner if they don't do anything because people who wait in League Elixir usually play like a heavier deck like a beat down deck that uses tornado so he does have arrows score princess in the back here obsolene and he goes skeleton i'm just going with mighty miner same lane here you don't want to play like your cards in front of your princess like in this instance because this is very hard to defend when they like have yeah exactly like when he does zappies like that so i'm gonna rocket these zappies here and yeah that's gonna go down um Okay, he's no barbs. Interesting. Okay, very weird. So I'm just gonna pop this Mind Miner ability here. Try like some use out of it. Get some damage. Uh, we're just going for a cannon. Hmm. Okay, this guy's playing a crazy deck for sure. I'm still going back to our Mind Miner, making sure that we kill the giant, not risking him having like a spell to kill our cannon. Okay, that's fine. So we spawn to the money miner, which is very good. Ooh, Sparky, I'm gonna rocket that. And he's probably gonna go with Zappy's last second, which is okay. But he's going for Hunter. I'm gonna pop the ability here, help damage it, and so we don't have to worry about it too much defending. You just defend it with a log and don't take any hits. So just like this. Alright, don't wanna go Gombro just yet because he has a lot of cheap defense like arrows or Zappy's like Create a counter push. Okay. Um, just going for a skill king there. Mm, I'm just going for a cannon. I can go back to another one when I need it. Yeah, he's going to go for barbs. Let's go princess like this. Ooh. Okay, I'm going to go money miner down low for the giant. And let's go for a gombro inside because my zappies. Okay, he's not. Let's go for rocket making sure that that zappy doesn't reset onto the giant. Okay, looking very solid here. Okay, only taking like two zappy hits for just one. I'm gonna pop the ability here, help um, keep it alive longer. Uh, we're also going for a cannon to help defend, just to cycle it. Going for another princess here. Okay, let's go for a gombro right away. Um, I think we need another cannon here for defense. It's gonna get kind of clunky. 
If it was barbs, we're not getting kited, so we gotta go for a fire spit here. Ooh. That spark was kind of boring, so let's go for ability here. Dodge it. And we're gonna defend it using log and other stuff. Let's go with skeletons like this so we can't prediction zap it on top. Kiddo's barbs were kind of whack. Yeah, this guy's like playing with a lot of cards. Jeez. Uh, let's go for a log here, trying to kill his zappies. Okay, messed up there. Let's go for skeletons so we don't take too many hits from the zappy there. Okay, looking very good. We do have a matchup. He just has arrows, which is kind of bad a struggle for him. I kind of feel bad because he has to deal with all the spam. Okay, I'm going to rock that. And circle back to my rocket when he uses a sparky here in a second. Let's go with the cannon. Skelly's here. Ooh, Graveyard. Interesting. Uh, let's go for a Princess down low here. Logging this and going for a Fire Spirit here. Okay, we don't take that much damage. This guy's a deck is just too expensive. Like, it's not working out for him. We're actually going to rock that. Go for Gombra like this. Just applying pressure. Okay, he messed up his barbs. Whenever your opponent has like Barbarians or Zappies, or guards, you want to play your Gombrel inside the tile, inside the tower because they're not going to expect that position. Alright, next game here against Delt, so we're going to go for Gombrel in the corner here because I don't know what this guy's playing. He's going for guards, okay. Um, we're very tempted to log those, but I'm not sure if I'm going against log bait. Let's go for Princess here, let's play safe. Okay, Lava. So I'm going to try to pressure here, like going like all in because he used his guards. And I'm just hoping to tower trade or do something. Okay. Okay, I'm not gonna use the ability, I don't think it's worth it. Yeah. It's not get that much it's not gonna get that much damage. Alright. I think what I like about Fire Spirit versus Ice Spirit is that you can full counter a balloon here. Nice. He played those minions in the wrong spot, so it's gonna go to a different lane. Let's go for a high skelly here, try to like distract the puffs a little bit. Okay, that's not bad. Okay, very good start is our tower is super healthy and we can start attacking his left side tower now because there's gonna be a point in the game where we can't defend all the time. Okay, he goes to the weird tombstone. Let's go princess here. I think it was better for the princess to be towards the same lane as the tombstone, but whatever. Okay, I'm just going mining miner in the back, have nothing better to do. If we go Gombro, he's going like zap arrows or something, it's not getting any value. Okay. Hmm, it's going to get tricky. We have a very interesting cycle. Um, hmm. I don't want to use my log because he has guards. Okay, I want to pop the ability here, the mining miner. Cannon should defend. Okay, cannon, good job. Go for princess here. He's gonna fireball the princess, I bet. Yep, because the fireball. At least he played a fireball toward that tower. Okay, this guy's here. Okay, I'm just cycling back to whatever card to defend these minions. So my are here. Okay. Let's pop the ability now. Rocket everything here. I go for a fire spirit like this. Go for skeletons here to pull back the minions, please. Okay, that kite was amazing. Let's for a high cannon. Should kite everything away. Oh. Okay, he's gonna take our tower there. Yeah, it's gonna be to the point where we can't defend that. Okay, there's a team sim. Let's go for a Gombro here. And then Mining Miner in the center, please. Okay, that was kind of a fail. That's fine. Let's go for a log, try to like force out guards or something from the opponent. Okay, force out Mega Minion. Get the ability down. Hmm. Still need to chip away on his, t in his, on his tower, so. Let's go for a log, Gone Barrel, Princess like this. Nice, played guards in the front. Oh, come on, please. I need the damage. I can't defend this lava push at all. Okay. Okay, yeah, I can't defend. Please need his rocket to come down. Alright. It's gonna be GG here. Yeah, I could not defend that push at all because 
two tower game, like you have only have one tower to defend, it's gonna be really hard. And nice game there. Okay, right, next game here for 7,300. Kind of funny how I'm trying to untilt to this 12v range, but that's fine. He's gonna start off with the fire spirit, so we're gonna do the same. And generally, you want to be like up in damage against these fire spirit decks, but it's probably a mirror matchup. Or, okay, well, let's go for skellies here. Help defend. Please. Oh, oh, that was very close. Like, I should not risk doing that. But that's fine. Um, hmm. Let's go for Gone Barrel. He might play Drill in the front. Yes, okay, that's good. Hold on, that log was very late. So I'm gonna go for Princess Applying Pressure here. Log at the ready in case he has something. Okay, he's gonna mind minor that. Uh, let's go for Cannon here. Okay, he does do that. Skelly, he's not back to his log, I don't think. So let's go for Gombrel here. Okay, it does waste one elixir, that's huge. Okay, wow. And a lot of elixir there. Let's go for Princess. He does have log back, but he's gonna get take one hit. Yeah. I'm not sure if that was a good trade or not, but I just want to try to get as much damage as possible so you can uh, finish them off with rocket cycling and double and triple. That's how you win these um, matchups. Let's for cannon here. Okay, let's go for a log now. Against wall breakers, you never want to play your cannon too close down to your tower because they may like splash onto your tower and you'll take a bunch of um, unnecessary damage that way. So. Try to play your cannon like a little higher to defend the wall breakers. Okay. Um, let's go Princess in the back. Try to beat out his fireball. Let's for a high cannon here so he doesn't fireball the tower or he'll have a tough time doing so. Okay, I'm just going to go Mind Miner in the back to activate a three card cycle here so we don't get out cycled by anything sus. So, okay. The fire Spirit here. Oh, that log was amazing, but. Oh, I thought the log did it. So I'm just going for Gombrel Rocket here. In this position, PC my fireball and miss. Okay. So we actually hit the fire spirit, which is massive. Um okay, I'm gonna pop the ability. Why not? Go for cannon like this. He's gonna rush us again. That's expected. Let's go for log here. The first goblin. Oof, that is very bad. Oh. Okay, that was kind of a bad defense. Sorry guys. Let's for rocket here. Okay, wasted that. Did to log this. Okay. Playing an unnecessary princess for like no reason. Getting a fireball value is not the go to. So let's go for a princess like this here. Mining miner here. Okay, he's gonna go in. When you go back to our log, that's our only good counter here to the drill. Okay, he does have the glitch spot, which makes it worse. Okay, that's fun. Okay, we're gonna go for a Gombrel and Tricky Barrel here. Try to catch him off guard. He sees it, that's well played. Okay, let's go for Skeletons here. Log here. Fire Spirit like this. Okay, that Fire Spirit was not needed. Okay, let's go for Gombrel here. Okay, he messed that up, he messed that up. Please rock it for the win. Gets me close. And GG. Okay, very close game. Definitely got intense for you he kind of outcycled us, not gonna lie. But hope you guys enjoyed the video and slowly untilting his meta's kind of horrendous. Like a lot of RG and a lot of Lava Hound, but just breaking through and hopefully those balance changes come soon and change the meta of the game. And please like and subscribe and see you guys later. Bye guys. Don't got a